fashion, despite being a young industry in Thailand, is generating a huge amount of income for the kingdom. Hoping to enhance the progress and talents of young Thai fashion designers, the Department of Industrial Promotion, or DIP, is organizing a workshop for selected designers, while introducing four fashion themes for them to follow. Kunotwarang, Kunotwarang Niam Wanitgun reports. In Thailand, the fashion industry already accounts for approximately 2% of total GDP. In 2014, the fashion industry generated 620 million baht and has a continuous expansion rate of around 4 to 5% a year. Within five years, the market value of the fashion industry in Thailand is expected to reach a trillion baht. Despite the ongoing growth in the value of the fashion industry in Thailand, the Department of Industrial Promotion, or DIP, recognizes the importance of Thailand's fashion industry and plans to make Thailand the fashion hub of ASEAN. DIP saw the importance of this industry. We make a lot of beautiful jewelry, leather goods, and accessories of very good quality. We will encourage our designers to be more professional, able to see and understand the trends of the world, and how they can adjust to those trends to create their own brand, one that reflects their own identity and Thai culture. Doing fashion is not just about satisfying the needs of oneself, but rather satisfying the needs of the consumers. So we must develop designs that go along with the trends. Mr. Artis suggested four designs that are among emerging world trends as certified by fashion gurus. First is the tropical artisan, which is fashion inspired by nature, using raw materials that reflect a combination of natural beauty and craftsmanship, such as hand-woven fabrics and natural dyes that enhance the purity of materials. Snook Snan, an image suiting the street, Snook Snan takes on the carefree personality and lively attitude of the Thai people. Bold colors such as bright orange and techno green are used with a combination of fabrics such as jeans and stretchy cotton. Styling involves matching casual pieces with designer items, as well as rejuvenated second-hand pieces. Indochine, the melting pot of cultures in Thailand and Southeast Asia, is reflected in the unique style of all the buildings known as Chino-Portuguese architecture. And lastly, gender futurism. This trend is a reflection of the social and cultural complexity of modern cultures. Gender futurism explores the fading line between men's wear and women's wear through materials and color palette. In clothing, trends come and go, so designers must stay in tune with world events and respond to changes in society and adapt their designs to trends in popular culture. Not Warang, Niamonishukun, reporting.